Hi, welcome to my channel. In this video, I will teach you how to uh, use Apache Derby in your Java projects. So in this video, I will focus on embedded only. And in this video, I will teach you how to set up your Apache Derby, how to create a database, how to um, connect Derby to Java class. So let's proceed. Um, proceed to your Chrome. Then let's download uh, Apache Derby. Then this one, then download. Then if you're using this kind of version of Apache Derby, uh, you should replace your um, GDK into Java 21 because it won't run because um, this library required um, Java 21 because this is compiled by Java 21. So it won't error your driver. So let's proceed. Connect this one. Uh, select. Then to download the file, select this uh, bin. Bin that zip. To download the file. So it is done. Then open the file. Then unzip this file or extract the file. So Downloads so extracting while extracting. Um, let's proceed uh, to NetBeans. Then select. Uh, let's create new project. Then let's put a uh, Derby uh, tutorial. Then here uh, let's re uh, remove the tutorial. Then click finish. Then let's delete this. Uh, statement in main method and here okay let's check so it is uh extracting then proceed to your mb nbn repository then let's download the uh, um libraries uh dependency so let's download the de dependency so type here in derby okay click search so here, this is the Derby uh, embedded. So click this one. So click this one. Then um, copy. Then back to your NetBeans here. Then let's type here uh, dependencies. Then dependency. Paste. Okay. Then uh, this is the first. Then let's comment this scope because it will error your uh, connection. So let's leave this comment. Okay, let's proceed. Uh, let's import the other dependency. So leave this one. So this client, uh, let's copy this uh, depend, uh, dependency. Copy. Then back to your net bins. Then here, the next one is we need to go back. Then here, okay, there be there be client. This one, oh, uh, it is done. So this this one, there be tools. Okay, because this uh library library. library as the driver so this is also important okay um, back to nbn repository then next one um, derbynet this one derbynet copy this library okay this PB, I think this is four. Okay, this four. Control save. Let's see if there's one more. Oh, there's no, there's none. So let's proceed to the extracted file. This one downloads. Uh, downloads here this one 
Okay. So here, uh, this is the library. So open your LibVille. So let's create database here. So we don't have yet a Java DB here. Uh, this one. In the old version, you can add here in your database location, but this is not um, suggested to me. Uh, for me, so here, uh, let's create a driver here. New driver, so um, add, add library. So let's proceed to download. Then this one, then there will be, then this one library. Okay, here we need to select this one, select this one, select, select, select this one. Um, maybe this the seven. To avoid error, uh, we don't need to include this local uh, because this is sec, China, Russia. I don't know. This one is Japan, Hungary. So this is this is. Uh, we need to import this uh, five, six, seven, seven ter file. So here, uh, because this is embedded, we need to choose the embedded driver. This one, then OK. So we have here added here Java DB. So right click this uh, file, then here we need we can create the database. So here, uh, let's say um, let's put um, Aldrin. Um, POS, then here let's put a uh, password for example Aldrin, then here Aldrin. Okay, then um, if we try to create connection here, it will error. Yeah, because not only the driver, because uh, not found, this database is not found. So able to create database here, um, let's put here semicolon, then true, oh no, uh, create, then equal, true. Then if we test the connection, it will create the database. Okay, successfully, okay, connection succeed. Okay, because the, this data database is created. Then when we try to connect, then it is, connected so click this uh, for example if you click this field next then there's there's a schema it's okay then next then this is the connection then click finish so where you can find this uh, the problem is where you can find this database alterin pos um when you create a database this um we create this in this netbeans so we can find this database in NetBeans. If you are uh, creating database using um, this one, for example, um, this project, the database we, you can see in this project. So let's try to find this um, database altering PWS. So let's find this project. To find the project, this is C. And this one, you need to see the because this is hide the file, so you should select this uh, hidden items to view the um, hide files. So let's proceed to user, then this one, uh, my user, then this one, app data. Because we are using NetBeans in creating Java Derby, you can find this in uh, NetBeans. So roaming, <clears throat> then click this netbeans, then 20, then derby. Then you can find here in the connection is Aldrin POS. For example, if we try to create another uh, database, so let's create here. <clears throat> Connect using, for example, let's put um, Aldrin, oh no, um, let's put student. DB okay, then let's put our name, uh, username and password here. Aldrin, so let's put semicolon, then create 
then equal true then click finish so this is created so if we try to see that there be there's a student db this is the database <clears throat> so let's proceed how to connect using using java so create this uh, let's proceed then uh, let's type the um, connection here um, let's put here um, url string then url equal string then let's see here okay we want to see uh, properties then let's copy this one no oh no uh, let's copy this one okay um <clears throat> okay. Then string for the user name. Um, this is Aldrin. Then um, make it bigger. Then string. Then password. Then let's um, put try catch here because this is the um, the driver manager manager required um, try catch. So catch exception. Then here let's uh, put class uh, class. Then for name string here. Then the driver which is org. Then um, Apache. So you can see it here in the dependency. Then these tools. Then you can see the this one. There's a connection here, which is embedded, embedded driver, this one. So let's see. Um, Apache, then Derby, then GDBC, then embedded, embedded driver. Then <clears throat> next is the connection. So here you need to put your connection um, con connection equals null um, null. Then let's import this one. Um, Java that is SQL that connection so next is let's put here connection equal driver uh, manager this one then <clears throat> let's put here um get connection get connection which is it's not on uh, this one url then password okay then let's put here miss uh, message system and uh, database connected okay if it is error then let's put here um, system connection error okay so let's try to run this project if we what you can see in this um, class 
if it is error or correct run <coughs> Okay, so there's error here because um, this Aldrin POS is not found because um, this database created by NetBeans, this is not um, created by, um, which is, this is not created by NetBeans. Oh no, Java project, this is created by NetBeans. So let's um, try to connect. So here, let's copy the, Location, this one. Okay, then paste here. Then the name of the database, Aldrin POS. Then let's try to run the project. Run. So, there's error. Okay, class loader. Um, start, fail to start database. Um, Aldrin POS. This is correct. Um, okay, so let's try to disconnect this. Um, this one, disconnect. Then let's try to run the project because that is connected. It has do, do two connection. Okay, the user name Aldrin is not valid. So let's try to see. Oh no, a URL. This is a username. So let's try to run the project. It is connected. So our database is connected. So we can connect to the um, database from this code. So if we try to create database using this um, Java class, as you can see here, uh, let's remove this one, uh, the location of the database then here. Let's put here create equal then true then semicolon then let's try to run the project so it will create um database <clears throat> so the location of this project inside the project so you can find this uh, database inside in this um, Java project, there will be tutorial, so if we can proceed to documents. Then on uh, bins tutorial, this one. Then we have we found this uh, database Aldrin POS. So that's how the Derby embedded works. So let's okay. So in this video, um. And in next video, I will teach you how to um, use um, client server in Derby, how to manage the server. So thank you guys for watching. See you next video. Bye.